Hello good dear friends. Today we have a very nice question here in which we are to calculate the length of this line BD. We can see the length of this side is 3 meters, this is 2.75 meters and this 3.25 meters. This side we can see is parallel to this side and this angle here is a right angle. So how can we solve it? Well since this is a right angle that implies that this triangle ABD is a right angle triangle and according to the Pythagorean theorem the square of the hypotenuse of a right angle triangle is equal to the sum of the squares of the two other sides. In triangle ABD this is the hypotenuse because it is the side facing the right angle and according to Pythagoras the square of its length is equal to the sum of the squares of the length of this side and this side here. If we write it out, line BD all squared equal to line AB squared plus line AD squared. But line AB is 3 meters and 3 meters all squared is 9 meters squared. So line BD squared equal to 9 square meters plus line AD squared. Now what is the length of line AD? We don't know. But if we draw another line from this point C, that's parallel to this line AB, and label this point it touches P, we're going to have a rectangle ABCP. And we know the opposite sides of a rectangle are equal in length. That is, this side and this side here are congruent. So this is also 3 meters. And this and this side here are also congruent. Definitely, this is also 2.75 meters. Now we know that this angle is a right angle. Because this side is parallel to this side, which is a triangle with this side. And therefore, this triangle CDP is also a right angle triangle. And by Pythagoras, the square of this hypotenuse is equal to the sum of the squares of this line CP and this line DP. So line CD squared equal to line CP squared plus line DP squared. But line CD is 3.25 meters and line CP is 3 meters. 3.25 meters all squared is 10.5625 meters squared and 3 meters all squared is 9 meters squared. Subtracting 9 meters squared from both sides, here 9 meters squared minus 9 meters squared is 0 and here 10.5625 meters squared minus 9 meters squared is 1.5625 meters squared. Taking the square root of both sides, here square cancel square root. And here, square root of 1.5625 meters squared is 1.25 meters. So 1.25 meters equal to line DP. That's the length of this line DP. Now since this line DP is 1.25 meters in length, and this side AP is 2.75 meters, that means the total length of line AD is 2.75 meters plus 1.25 meters, which is 4 meters. If we substitute into this equation now, Line BD squared equal to 9 meters squared plus 4 meters all squared. 4 meters all squared is 16 meters squared. 9 meters squared plus 16 meters squared is 25 meters squared. If we take the square root of both sides of the equation now, here square root of line BD squared is line BD, and here square root of 25 meters squared is 5 meters. So line BD equal to 5 meters, and that is the length of the side we are asked to calculate. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe and also turn the notification button for this channel. Thank you.